Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays RimWorld of Magic Royalty 1.1. I'm hoping that the uh, sound won't be desynced this time, but I do not know for sure if it will be. Because I'm not entirely sure what's causing it. Also, uh, I was suggested, and I appreciate the suggestion to, you know, try arresting Silvermane and seeing if he would uh, be okay after that. The stuff for when he's a prisoner shows up down here, but it disappears again once he's recruited. So I don't know what's going on with Silvermane. He won't listen to orders, but he will occasionally walk around and help. So I guess that's what's important. You got a couple of animals like Zelda with a little bit of a little bit of blood loss problem on them. It's unfortunate. We're almost done with researching sterile materials, and I have inspired taming. This is, theoretically, all very good for Bitcoin. Let's go ahead and give this warg that's out here the oof. See what our settlements are doing. I believe we have some taxes en route, and you know that's always a good time. Oh, you know it's a good time. Shark Walker, the Brave, with an extra magic point. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, Shark Walker also appears to be missing all of his everything. That, oh, that's because he's, that's because he's in a mental state. Oh, boy, I almost made myself twisted. Uh, sterile materials is done, which is good, because now we can make our some of our rooms a lot cleaner. And we have an extra use for all of that silver. Let's go ahead and get mortars next, because we can use the artillery mortars to actually shoot. I don't have anything to add to that. We can just use it to shoot, and that's great. Uh, let's go ahead and put some... Where the hell is that room? Put some sterilized tile in here. You know you gotta sterilize. Holy crap, we're actually out of silver. I don't know how that happened. Anyway, Sharkwalker has been calmed down by Silvermane. Who will now proceed to go do whatever he wants, which in this case he wants to shred mechanoids. I mean, he'll still listen to um, he still listen to his work priority, so there's that. Who's doing the hunt? Vasilla, Vasilla, you got this. Hell yeah, you do. Dad, then would let you shoot again. But, I mean, he still does stuff. He's tearing apart a centipede now. Who only gives us 9 blast steel and 27 steel. Oh. I have to assume that there is eventually going to be... I, I have to because I'm tired of being disappointed every time Tynan makes a change to something that's already existing in the game. Because they're almost they almost always suck. <laughs> Someone else might have made this change, actually. I don't know if it's a modded change or what. Uh, but, you know, he used to say disassemble mechanoid and you'd get some actual usable parts out of it. It may not be Titan. It might be something else. I'm not 100% sure. I have not investigated thoroughly. It, not that, that should that should surprise any of you, that is. Uh, Creo tried to do a little bit of mining. It didn't work out, but that's okay. Zenis, how you doing? You're looking great. With your swoot-ass Centurion helm and armor of the Valiant. And your tabard. He looks like a champ. And we got limestone blocks out the wazoo now. I love it. Thank you, Volpe. I'm not entirely sure what you did there, but thank you for it. I mean, you definitely came in to do it quickly. All right. Oh, there's a dead muffet over here. Yo, there's a dead EMP launcher over here. Yo, there's a dead dragon horn over here. And dragon leather. Get those inside, dude. That's a higher priority than a couple of TVs, trust me. Dragon leather's worth money. I have to assume. Alright, who do I want to learn this arcane bolt spell? I mean, I guess... I think Nat should learn it, because Sharkwalker has plenty of super powerful offensive spells already. That's the wrong one. So let's have him read this when he's done making some flour. Volpe got more skills to pay them magical bills. She also already has Arcane Bolt, so, you know, it is what it is. And in theory, that is what it is. Speaking of in theory, she should probably go ahead and throw down a Dirt Devil. And then, uh, Sharkwalker, are you up? You are not up, so never mind. But now, when you're done reading this... Read, 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 read. You should probably throw down a Dirt Devil. That's not Dirt Devil. Uh, a Dirt Devil. There you go. 
Okay. Yeah, you got two of them rummaging around. Keeping things a little bit more tidy. We really need it because it ain't very tidy. I mean, I could do more quarry work here, but... I mean, this, this quarry is almost completely used up. Oh, there's a steam geyser in here. I didn't even... That didn't even register in my head, but that's great. Yeah, that's perfect. Steam guys is just what we need, dude. Just... You are healing up, right? Zebra one. Uh, let's see. What's going on? Lack of supplies. Less weapon and base production in all oh, the apparel production in Neckwood. But we make a we make weapons in Neckwood, not apparel. I mean, that didn't seem to hurt it that much. And actually, we'll see how much the original effect would be once we get this... these weapons coming in here soon. Which should be soon enough. Assuming that is soon enough. Let's see, we got the diplomacy. Oh yeah, that's right, you want to meet at a nearby location. Let's meet up. Alright. I will go. Bring Demis with me. And we'll bring Shark Walker with us as well. You know what, let's Let's bring... Let's not bring Silverman, because if, if we end up bringing him and he can't fight, that's kind of terabad. So let's not do that. Bring some treated herbal meds. And... I'm not seeing any of my meat. Is that because someone's using the smoked meat? No, that's because there is no smoked meat in here. Oh, no! Guys, we need to smoke some of this meat. Also, we got a yellow dragon egg. It's pretty great. And Volpi successfully tamed a Kitsune. It's pretty great. We'll teach it to do everything. And wouldn't you know it? That's probably going to be pretty great. Major break risk for Miss Mask. She had to eat raw food. She shouldn't have had to. But for some reason, she's dead. I feel like food's not getting made fast enough. Taxes have arrived. From Neckwood, they have brought us an a uranium bill hook, a heavy machine gun, and some silver. Oh, and a uh, battle rifle. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. 12 damage, burst shot of 2. It ain't great, but it ain't bad. HMG, burst shot of 5. A little bit of damage. Some armor pen. Terrible accuracy. Like, good lord. What about this bill hook, though? Nats tamed the other Kitsune, by the way. 8 damage. Eh. Ain't the worst thing in the world. It's not like, you know, making me explode with anticipation. Poor Treewick, of course, bringing in the pure ass money. Ain't no way to complain about that. All right, Neckwood, let's stop bringing in weapons. Just maybe swap us over to meals. Let's see what happens. Oh, this is going to be dangerous for profit. Oh, God. Oh, dearie me. I mean, look, if we did this, we would still be in a, in the positives. So, there's still an argument to do this. Then we can put money in somewhere else. Where we have... Oh god, no, not there. It looks like wood is probably our best bet. No, it's not. Animals is our best... Oh, because that's 144. I misread that. The animals is definitely our best bet there. Alright, alright. Neckwood, maybe we give you a nice upgrade? I don't want to be left with 300 silver, especially when we still haven't gotten this floor done. So I'm probably going to hold off on that. Wait until that is done. Wait until we have mortars and we can replace this catapult because it's kind of garbage. Yo, the barn's almost done. The new barn. All right. Got to paint up the barn. Let's see. Yeah. Give me a nice shade of that red. Uh, yeah, 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 like that. Um, 1800 wood from Swampwood. Yeah, that's, that's what I would expect. And you know what? 100% ain't mad. I wanted wood. I got wood. White barn doors. 
You know, I got exactly what I bargained for. So how can I complain? I'll give you a pro tip. I can't. I don't know how that's a pro tip, but it, that would imply that there was something I was tipping you on. Uh, give me all the stuff that's in here that we can harvest. A lore keeper named Rabbit has joined the colony. She is 39 years old. She, uh, oh, oh, she knows blood magic. A trigger happy blood mage. Old baby. Consigned to the dark art of manipulating the lifeblood of living beings as a means of increasing her power. She's learned to control the life force within and command it to her will. Her connection to life makes it easier to associate with other living things. Which is an interesting aside. Uh, she also likes social and artistic. Uh, however, but doesn't appreciate effort without immediate results. Blood sacrifice. Combines blood and mana to a hybrid form of power used to perform blood magic. The use of blood sacrifice inflicts several deep cuts to allow ready access to blood and combine it with mana to generate an immediate amount of blood magic power. Blood mages can slowly regenerate blood magic from open bleeding wounds without the use of mana and can also train to use fresh exposed blood near them to fuel blood magic. A blood mage will slowly lose blood magic power when they are no longer bleeding. So she has to bleed herself. Also, nice cape. Rend. Causes the victim's blood to violently reject the toast and it erupt from multiple wounds, resulting in massive hemorrhaging. So you have to sacrifice enough blood to use this. So I used that, and she has now made herself bleed with a couple of bloody cuts. All right. Well, that's neat. So we can up blood sacrifice, of course. Reduces the amount of the mana cost of blood sacrifice and reduces the blood cost of all blood magic. Increases the amount of blood magic gained through blood sacrifice. Hmm. Allows her to draw fresh blood from the ground. Ooh. Nice. Stefan is ready to develop a combat skill, by the way. Uh, more strength. Yo, uh, <laughs> we're out of beds. I mean, the, the, you know, the solution to that is make more beds, obviously, but... Can we pop one down right here? Do we have enough space? We do not have enough space. That hurts me in the face. Yeah, there's not enough space over here, and that's not, that's not big enough. So we could just make some more beds over here. Yeah. Congrats! You're part of our, you know, section two. We'll build you, build you a bedroom in a jiffy. Don't you worry, rabbit. A blood mage. Interesting. So she can learn Ignite Blood. Exposes any blood in an intense... Or burns and ignites any exposed blood in an intense flash fire. Blood for blood curses a target's blood to heat and accelerate until it seeps from every pore. Well, yeah, of course it would have several effects. Holy cow. Blood shield. Surrounds a target in a barrier form from the blood energy of the caster. The energy will slowly regenerate the pawn it is protecting. Oh, that's neat. Any damage done to the shield disperses some of its energy, but also causes a burst of healing on the protected pawn. Portion of the damage absorbed by the shield will be inflicted on the caster due to the blood link. This includes the gradual healing. Oh. As long as a blood mage supporting the shield has blood magic power, any return damage will detract from this blood power. But if blood mage is out of blood magic, return damage will cause physical harm to the blood mage. Blood mages cannot form a blood shield on themselves. And then finally, Mystic Claw causes the victim's blood to violently... That's the one we have. Uh, that's red, not Mystic Claw. I was looking down here. And then finally, there's a Blood Moon. Surround, ooh, surrounds an area in blood magic, calling forth demons of rage and terror to prey on enemies within. Wow. Uh, we have defended Neckwood from the Ravagers, and by we, I mean the boys of Fort Trewick. Due to your overwhelming victory, the military force is still available for deployment. That is kind of awesome. I will give you that. It's still super RNG, but, you know... The fact that you can get something positive that's not just, oh, hey, you won. The next force is coming in three days and you have to wait five days to use them again. Fuck you. You know, it's definitely an improvement. 10 out of 10. Good job. Uh, let's see. What are we using here? 530 watts. So we'll have uh, 470 left over for other projects if necessary. 
We got a lot of things to build. So I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna put any more blueprints down right now. Our lads got plenty to do. Yo, can I get someone... Someone who is a skilled constructionist. Uh, Frank, maybe? Can I get you to concentrate on... Not Thunder's working on the bed. Can I get you to concentrate on this bed, maybe? Yeah, get that done. Now concentrate on this bed. I want the beds done. Even if she has to sleep outside in the rain, she can at least do it on a somewhat comfortable bed. Picking up what I'm putting down. You swimming in what I'm skimming in? I don't even know what that means. You skimming in what I'm... I don't know, man. I'm not, I'm not going to try to make sense of that phrase. It was nonsensical, and I apologize for it. All right. Bed is done. It is good. It is not great, but it is good. And we will take good right now. Because that means Rabbit has a place to sleep. Creo with the bad mood. Ravenously hungry. What the heck, dude? Let's make some food. I really think uh, we need to start... I think I've done the right thing over in Neckwood. We are going to lose some money in the short term. But in the long term, we will get food. And I think we need that. Uh, and you know, actually, eventually, this is going to be the right way to go. But eh, actually, let's keep it like that. Because by the time next tax season rolls around, I believe... Kalizo's 38 years old, by the way. Uh, never mind. <laughs> I'm wrong. I was going to say, by the time next tax season runs works around that bad effect is going to be gone no it won't no it dang diddly won't okay upgrade this town i think we have more than enough silver now to get this done i hope so at least there you go see rabbit has a place to sleep so there it is blood magic an interesting non mana source thousand cuts I mean, yeah, there's a lot of really neat ideas here. Increases the damage of all blood magic. I like this idea of that she can just soak up blood from the ground. I wonder if she could soak up, like, hunted creatures' blood. So she's, like, intellectual, artistic, and social. Which is all fine and good and good and fine. You could actually... It's kind of nice to have someone else who will do art. Let's have her do art at a high priority. Have her entertain at a pretty high priority as well. And definitely research, too. But it'll be nice to have someone who can do art for us, because we could probably use more art. Just in general. A uh, masterwork dresser has been made. It is an image of Psy standing next to Aunt... Uh, Athanasia Riggs grave while gazing at a faraway mesa. It refers to him visiting her grave. Very descriptive. Thank you. Very well done. Holy crap, Stefan, you goofed that up bad. Relations with the ragamuffins are going up. That's good. Nat eating some raw food. That's less good. At least the raw apples are still tasty. Let's go ahead and put in a... Wait, rabbit's not assigned to... Oh, you know what? It's probably still an order for... Uh... Yeah, I bet you I know what it is. It's it's dumb if that is it. Yeah, not assigned to tailoring. That's a little dumb, but it's okay. All we gotta do is go over here to rabbit. Look for crafting. And see if we can get make rugs on here by itself. We probably won't. Gem cutting table, crafting, printing table, crafting spot. Nope, it doesn't look like it. That sucks. I mean, I understand it, but it sucks. Who would have priority five, which is not a high priority at all. Very purposely. Okay. It is what it is, though. And in theory, that's all that it is. You're picking up what I'm putting down. Bobby, why are you... <laughs> Food poisoning? Again? How are you always getting food poisoning? Um, You know, it doesn't say how long we have to do this. But I assume we can jump to it whenever. I'd love to have some food down for us before I do it, though. 
That'd be a nice start. So what is what is rabbit do? Oh, this one's done. Okay, good. We can now research down here. Yo, can we fit one of these in the center? Let's go right past it, Fed. Good job. I mean, we could for now. Obviously, it'll be better to have a multi-analyzer in there. So I think we're just going to not and wait for that to become a multi-analyzer spot. So we could probably just move these out now. Kind of tell these to go away. A shaman merchant from the Shek Kingdom has arrived. How y'all doing? Welcome to this. It's pretty great. At least I'm liking it. Okay, they have comfy chairs down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very comfy chairs. So I don't think they need anything else. This rug ain't that great. <laughs> Ended up being a piece of trash. Yo, what's loading? Of course, it's a raid from the Ravagers, who have arrived in transport pods. They will prepare for a while and then attack. Uh, can't bring... Silvermane due to video games, so... Let's see where everyone else be dropping. Oh, are they all dropping from right there? Because that would be beautiful. No, there's at least two drop points, it looks like. Okay. Whoa, that's a tough one. Oh, boy. They have a minigun. They have a wooden mallet. That's not as tough. Triple rock. And this one over here. Who has a lot of units. Not to, I, wanna, I can't select them all. Uh, a bronze greatsword. Interesting. Do I have royal aid available? I do. Okay. I have royal aid. I don't think our knight thunder has it available. Oh, he does. Okay. Okay. We, so we have plenty of aid available. To help us. And obviously we have some pretty swood magic as well. They will prepare for a while and then attack. Thank frick. Uh, Miss Mask, go take care of yourself. Everyone else come over here. Them preparing for a while will be their downfall. Obviously. Because if they can gather in the same spot... We can hit him with a few good things. Let's gather ourselves over here first. Okay. Gather. Ray Ray, set up your mortar. Okay. He's developed the combat skill. His mortar's already upgraded all the way. His self-aid's upgraded all the way. Uh, let's upgrade damage of combat abilities. Here they come. All right, a little bit of free damage. Not gonna lie, it wasn't 10 out of 10, but wasn't expecting it to be. Okay, who's next? Next up, let's send out Thunder. Thunder, call in some boys. Here come the Exodus Empire. We called them in again, we would lose some royal favor. They gave us a bunch of melee idiots. Oh, God. Thanks, Exodus Empire. Oh, good. That guy went supernova. He's a commander. Ah. All right. Well, uh, what was that? A paladin. Oh, okay. So she's got some skills. They didn't pay the bills that much, but uh, she had them. All right. My turn, I guess. Let's call in my mercs. Let's try to call them in the middle of the enemy group if we can. There we go. Hide. Next step will be to have Dismas come over here. And go for some easy shoot juice if possible. It might not be. You never know. All right, they were about as effective as I was basically expecting them to be at this point. Okay, it looks like they are actually heading forward. So, we need to get into defensive positions. Yeah, let him take that one shot and then pull Dismas out of here. What? That 
was bull crap, dude. I know that thing was not in the way. I got gypped, man. I got gypped hard. Okay, everyone pull up. All right. It's all right, we got heals. Yes, we do. We got heals, etc., etc., etc. Uh, Nat, are you here? You are here. Yeah, let's go ahead and get your heals in first. There we go. Get right here, see what we can do. Shark Walker, I kind of want to save your attack for there, so you know what? Give me a smoke cloud right here. There we go. And then move, move some more boys down. Oh yeah, they shouldn't be able to get into the smoke cloud basically at all. And by that, I mean I, they should have trouble shooting us from the smoke. Ah, uh, sil- Oh god, I can't control Silvermane. I cannot control him. Uh, stay in the home area, dude. Jeebus. Of course, you get a direct hit. Because video games. Get over here, Volpe. Okay, well, another one's down. So that's nice. Volpe, please. <laughs> there you go. Fully healed. Alrighty then. Oh, we had two points. Nice. Okay, give Scylla up here. And I'm thinking the rest of us, let's go ahead and move over and get ready to take on the other group. Mainly because this group has lost a lot of people so far. And I think if we ha if we leave Volpe and Thet behind to back up Dismas and Vasilla, we'll probably be okay. Actually, you know, I can skip myself. But only with where I have line of sight. One more. Okay. And then just skip myself over here. Bam. Stun goes away. I can shoot. Beautiful. Okay. My gun's worth a bit, so... Me being able to shoot is a surprisingly big thing. Okay, the other team is beginning their assault now. Get up here. Sharkwalker, I'm gonna want you to start. And you know what I want you to start. We just have to... We have to know where they're coming from first. Holy crap, what was that? That did not seem like a heavy SMG or anything. That sounded like something bigger, but okay. Whatever you say, game. Start healing. I might have to fake down now. Yeah, I've, I've gotten hurt quite a bit. I'm going to fake down. Bulpy, get out of the way. Shark Walker. Go ahead and lay down the Firestorm right about... Are they coming this way? I think they are. Uh, sorry, Kalizo, about your birthday party. Come on, how many more of them need to go down before they run? Can you throw down a mana shield for... No, you can't. I don't know why you can't throw it around someone else. You know? I feel like that's something that should be in the game. But, for some reason, it's not. No oh, crud, they destroyed that rock. Oh, God! Okay. Me. Get up. Shoot someone. Okay. Fake down. <laughs> this will work. Probably. Okay. Throw down Firestorm right here. Throw down Firestorm? Throw down Firestorm right here. Okay. We're getting healed as fast as they are doing anything to us, so... They're going to get hopefully destroyed by those. These guys are running away. So we're fine over there. Get my ass up. They're done. Get poopy. I said get poopy. There goes poopy. All right. Good job, lads. The healing from Hyena over here made a huge difference. And I think me deciding to undraft everyone at the same time, it may have actually crashed the game. Oh my god, I do I hope I'm wrong. 
But I guess we'll find out next time. Here on that plays Rimworld of Magic Royalty 1.1. If if it did, I'm I'm actually kind of upset. But uh, <laughs> we'll find out next time. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure to let me know by giving it a like. If you haven't already, there it goes. Feel free to subscribe for more. Should be up 16 died. I'm sorry, because uh, it's gonna keep coming and won't stop coming. But until next time, thanks again for watching this episode of Fett Plays Rimworld of Magic Royalty 1.1. My name is Fett. Uh, it doesn't look like we had any permanent damage. Uh, let's get over here to uh, Hyena and we'll do some heals. And I will see you in the next video, my dudes. Alright. He'll be fine.